Hello, hello. Welcome back, welcome back. It's your boy, Me Man Mellow. Coming to you back live with some more Assassin's Creed 4. Black Fang. All right, lads. I'll give you Blackbeard's honest opinion. You ask me, can this new cap... That was a rumble, by God. How do we fare? A fine purchase, no mistake. Now I think it's time to lay low and drive our way back into secrecy. Agreed. So, how do we get rid of this notoriety we've stirred up? Money, my boy. A well-placed bribe to the right government official. See the military off your tail. Right, let's do that. I'll need to meet these good Samaritans at some point. Smart thinking. low profile. That's our cannons. What's our cannons? Oh my god. Thank you for your support. We need cannon. You're a wonder, Kenway. You've a knack for this kind of work. It ain't work if you love it. Ah, ah, spot. But I ain't doing this forever, lads. Only until I get enough coin to buy some land and influence back home. Jesus, will you listen to your trite? Still dreaming all about that strumpet back in England when you could have any better you wanted here and now. Ah, such lofty goals for you, gents. And here I thought I was in the company of scoundrels. Fine purchase today. What's the crew's mood? All smiles and no teeth. And there's a few talking about meeting with Master Kid to steal from a nearby plantation. Plantation? That's ambitious. Profitable too, if we can manage it. 
Hi. Hmm. It's a good idea. James Kidd. Why, look, it's the bastard son of the late William Kidd. Still a mere boy, and yet ten times the demon his father was. Fancy seeing you here, can we? Still looking sleek and mean. Did you steal that costume from a dandy in Havana? No, sir. I found this on a corpse. One that was walking about and talking shite to my face only moments before. Huh. So, what's this I hear about a planned raid on a plantation? Not keeping secrets from me, are you? Not very well. Every day, schooners packed with sugar sail past, coming from plantations nearby. Most times, they stop here, sell off a few crates. There's one man visiting today that had earned you a fine profit. So if you'd like to rob his plantation, I'll point him out. I would. Hmm. Is it a Mr. Beckford that owns this plantation? That's the man. He owns dozens round these islands. And he's bloody rich. Just the sort I like to see robbed. His agent is around here somewhere. Find and follow him. And he'll lead you straight to your guard. We trade a fight with Mr. Beckford knows our fair. And with a quality he knows is sound. Aye, it is hearty molasses and raw cane. That's a given. It gladdens me to hear your saying so. But despite the waywardness of your enterprise here, I understand that you are men of discernment.
Burford, Manning, to me. We've done with this place. Aye, sir. What's our course? We'll return to the plantation and there take stock of our inventory. Good harvests. You might not talk so loud, sir. This isn't anything like a friendly port, can it? Nonsense, man. I had a delightful conversation with a chap just now. We came to quite an understanding. As you say, sir. Haul up and unfurl, boys. We're going home. Oops. Really? Really, Jay, you go to damn front. Captain, you have the look of a man crafting a bold idea. The look I've seen before. You mark well, Ade. I've just overheard one of the Beckford's men talking grandly about his plantation and all the cargo he's keeping there. And it gave me the idea that I might take these goods off him and sell them off for a better price than he'd ever ask. <laughs> ah, a man of vision. I like this idea. Reef the foreman! Stand down! Let's hold at it. There's trouble to fall. I see them. We must tread lightly. His waters are reefing well all top. working for Peter Beckford's people. Did you know them? The Beckfords and their sugar empire. Aye. The Beckfords and the Draxes. I never worked their plantations, but I knew their names from hearing other men curse them. But you worked a plantation, no? A modest one, aye. As a striker in the boiling house. Boiling house? Was it water they boiled? Or something else? Cane juices. It's a hard process making sugar. Dangerous. It must be why it fetches such a dear price. What's it like? Toiling on a plantation day and night. Well, with the cane sugar cut and harvested, it's run between two metal rollers that crush the juice from the plant. After collecting the juice, it was time to boil away the waters from the sugar. This we did in tatches made of copper. But let me tell you, brother, boiling sugar is near the hottest thing on earth. Just a touch on the skin will stick like bird lime and burn on, leaving a terrible scar. Jesus. Oh, 
It's a risk to anchor too close. The soldiers roving the plantation would catch us for sure. Drop here then and sneak ashore. We'll look after the jackal. such disarray. Bit of a do, sir, that's all. It's Wilmington's birthday. And you saw fit to get pickled on duty. No bother, sir. We have everything sorted. We'll soon see, won't we? For you must double the watch this evening. Double, sir? What about four? By piloting my eyes on me, though the ship was uncommonly large for such rascals. Certainly wasn't slavers, though. Not a ship that size. In any case, double the watch. And keep your damned eyes wide for anything suspicious. You up there! Look alive, man! You've a job to do! Apologies, sir. I'll keep my eyes peeled. going on here today? How do you suppose you'll be able to ring that alarm if you're pissed drunk and barely able to stand? I require entrance to the warehouse. Darn it. You saw fit to get pickled on duty. No bother, sir. We have everything sorted. You'll soon see, won't we? For you must double the watch this evening. Double, sir? large for such rascals. Certainly wasn't slavers, though. Not a ship that size. In any case, double the watch. And keep your damned eyes wide for anything Job to do. Apologies, sir. I'll keep my eyes peeled. For God's sake, what the hell is going on here today? How do you suppose you'll be able to ring that alarm if you're pissed drunk and barely able to stand? Forgive me, sir. Huh? Come on. 
Come back, you weakly coward! Forgive me, sir. I am fit and able. If I see any strangeness about, you'll hear the bell ringing straight away, I promise. <coughs> I'd like to speak to the man in charge here. I require entrance to the warehouse. Which of you dogs has the key to the warehouse, huh? The key, goddammit! Someone find me the key! Is there no one sober here? Fetch me the warehouse key, if you please. You! Stop there! Shit! Alarm! Alarm! He's over there! Ah! In my sight! Oh. Here in sight! Oh. 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 Easy enough. <laughs> oh, hold on. Ah, okay, I gotta watch that. Six three fifty three, third quarter. First of all, fuck you and the click you came with. <laughs> y'all walked into that one. I'm sorry, y'all walked in. See, here you go. Here you go. When she called herself, when she called herself chocolate, when she had. Did she called us a chocolate when she dark hair man. Nope. In my sight, No, no. So you did not refer to yourself to chocolate. She's <laughs> 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 the give, give me give me hold on. Give me give me back Tim. No. 
Give him about 15 minutes. In about 15 minutes. Make this video long. Exactly. Straight up, like she said, burnt sugar. She said it, she said it. I'm just piggying back, that's all. She said it. You said it. I'll fail you, you, you put the thought in everybody here. Now everybody gonna look at some caramel and burn it. <laughs> you give me give me give me back 15 minutes. I gotta make this video alone. See Lala show out tonight. You, you gonna see a different side of Lala. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. Ease off the wind. From our trees off the wind. Call it all fly. We have those gallons. Lord. Uh-oh. Say it again. Say it again. Here's to our pirate <laughs> republic, lads. We're prosperous, free, and out the reach of kings, clergy, and deck collectors. Near 500 men now pledge their allegiance to the brethren of the coast in Nassau. Not a bad number. True. Yet we lack sturdy defenses. If the king were to attack the town, he'd trample us. Then let us find the observatory. If it does what these tablets claim, we'll be unbeatable. Not that twaddle again, can we? It's a story for schoolboys. I mean, proper defenses. Steal a galleon, shift all the guns to one side. We'll make a nice ornament for one of our harbors. It will not be easy to steal a full Spanish galleon. Have you one in mind? Oh, I do, sir. Well, and I'll show you. Oh, she she run the people She's out the party again. She is. Did that yesterday? She ah. did. She did that Sunday too. too slow. She did that Sunday too. Had my man mad and everything. Now you talking about people with maps? Dang, look. Dang, man. Hey, the man ain't got it like you. Why are you talking about the man like that, man? Hey, that could have been gas price. money. Pinched her from the Spanish, was it? Aye. That, that could have been gas money. In the money. midst of a hurricane. Just before the for treasure the fleet was smashed against the shore. Was the hall aboard man. as rich as men are saying? A thousand times that. I reckon a million pounds worth of reals was sunk that day. Devil love a hurricane. Boy, have a dive there the one day. See what we can rummage up. Diving them rocks would be a nice change of pace for us. No need for violent actions against merchants and such. Wow. 
That's some soft talk coming from a pirate. And as it happens, loot. I mostly agree. We'll save the clashing of cutlasses for the military. And them that get in our way. Oh lord. You may find out here. Like staring through a waterfall. Don't soil your breeches, lads. Hey, Got this. Hey, All weather there, Captain! Oh, there it is. Is okay. Big ass building. Hmm. 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 That ship's a monster. Look at the size of her. Oh damn. Aye. And we'd not last long face to face with her. Hear that, can we? Keep your distance. We'll strike when fortune favors us. The cover of darkness, most likely. Aye, oh, it may come at that. Ain't no one about to work. Is it uh, the big ass building map? Yes. Yes. Video and ten. Almost done with this mission. Brief the tossers and gather. Four. Okay. All loose all of it. Ashton, toss the wind. Incoming ship! Guns out! Man of war, sir! Spanish inside! Let out some sail! They are locked! Do not leave their muzzle! Aloft, lads! 
Check those royals. Wow. Scout the royals and top. Reef the foreman. As much strain as you can. Blues down, man your sheets. Take down this guy. Bravo, Captain. Wreck the survivor here, sir. Charles. Reckless as they come. An old friend of yours. Not a man I call a friend. But we've been doing this kind of work for so long, I can't help but respect you. Get of yours. Not a man I'd call a friend. But we've been doing this kind of work for so long, I can't help but respect the man. She can't do it. <laughs> Look, they fire mortars, Captain! Charles Bain slinking off. Between his leg. That's good news for us. Bleeding bastards! 
We'll have to deal with this skirmish fast. Oh, Forget the galleon and send these in or locers to sure. hell. For that island. I know the place. A natural stronghold used by a French captain named Ducasse. Julian Ducasse, the Templar. Named right. Didn't know he had a title. I know the man. And if he sees my ship, he'll know it from his time in Havana, meaning he may wonder at who's sailing her now. I can't risk that. But I don't want to lose that galleon. Let's think on. Maybe wait till it's dark before hopping aboard. I'm going to end it right there. This is your boy, Made Man Mellow. Stay tuned for more Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Probably more likely to be streaming tomorrow as well. So, stay tuned. Peace.